people say, right? Welcome to my channel, The Midnight Reader. My name is Rosica, and today is a special video because we have real life book mail. So story time. I just finished Akatar, which was A Court of Thorns and Roses. It was my first Sarah J Mass book, and I read it, and I had feelings about it. And if you don't know about Akatar, it's a it's a series of books and they're all really long because Sarah J Maas does not apparently edit anything that she writes. But I have a lot of feelings about it and I am waiting to review Akatar until I read the second book because everyone I've spoken to who's read Akatar has told me to reserve judgment until I read the second book uh, because it either changes dramatically for the better or for the worse. Who's to tell? Because I don't know yet. I haven't read it. And so I texted my real life book friend, Chelsea, who initially recommended the series to me. And I said, I have so many feelings and I am upset because there's a 12 week wait at the library and I don't know if I can wait that long to have feelings about books. So she responded immediately because she's the best and said, this is a book emergency. And so she mailed me <laughs> the next book. I think she mailed me all the books in Akatar actually. I'm not 100% sure what's in the package, but yes, this video is coming to you courtesy of my friend Chelsea. And to thank her for her kindness, I made a graphic and here's the graphic. This video is sponsored by Chelsea, sponsored by Chelsea, my real life book friend. You can't tell me that wasn't impressive. You know you're jealous. So we're gonna do our best to not show all the addresses of my friends and myself. So there may be some crafty editing in this, but we're gonna open it and these are my trauma shears, which are normally used to cut clothes off of people, but are actually really excellent at opening packages. So here we go. God, it's so well packaged. <laughs> it's like, it's really lovely packaged. Let me see if I can show you. Like, she clearly sent me all the Akatar. I'm so pleased. I did promise to not harm her covers, and I actually gave her a reference from someone else who I lent books to, who was like, Your your dust jackets are in such good shape. So I, I used <laughs> I had to send her a reference to make sure I wouldn't damage any of her books. She sent me a card tube, so we're gonna open that real quick. She she knows that I'm going to open this on booktube, so let's see. This is so cute. Okay, so she... <laughs> so when she first uh, said that she was going to mail me a package because this was a book emergency, um, I had teased her and said that she was sending me like the Noah's Ark of books <laughs> because she kept telling me she needed to find a package which was big enough. I think she sent me more than just the Akatar series. We're going to go through it. Oh, she sent me Still Lives. So if you watch my channel, you'll know that the only book list I subscribe to is the Not A Book Club Book Club, which is just purely something I made up with my friend Chelsea which is she recommended a bunch of books for me and I recommended a book, a bunch of books for her and there's no timeline on how long it takes us to read those books, but I'm still working my way through it. And one of the books she recommended is in here and I'm so excited. Thanks, Chelsea, I will text you. <laughs> Holy shit, your covers really are in pristine shape. I promise I will keep them beautiful, Chelsea, I promise. So this is the second book in Akatar, A Court of Mist and Fury. Oh, she sent them all to me. A Court of Wings and Ruin. And I think she might have little like bookmark annotations in there. Let's see. A Court of Frost and Starlight. This seems suspiciously small to be a Sarah J Mass. I'm guessing this is like a an in-between chonker books. She also sent me a Court of Thorns and Roses. Thank you for actually sending me this, Chelsea, because I still haven't done my review on Akatar. One of the problems with having library books as your main source of books is that it's hard to go back through and like highlight 
uh, certain passages or quotes from books. So this is actually really helpful because when I go back and do my review, I'm going to use this as a reference for things. And lastly, this chunker, A Court of Silver Flames. I'm so excited to read these. These are, it's just a pure, pure popcorn reading for me. So I'm really excited to finish the series and I'm betting it's going to take me a little while, but I'm excited for it. And lastly, so this was one of the books on our Not A Book Club book club that she recommended for me. This is called Still Lives. It's like about a missing artist and she told me there's like a something in the front for me. So let's see. <gasps> Chelsea! Oh my god! She made me a Midnight Reader um, bookmark. Chelsea! What the? Oh. I think she painted this. She's been playing with screen printing, but I'm pretty sure she painted me this. Oh, Chelsea! Oh! Look how cute that is. It's perfect. It's like my channel background. Jesus! Now I'm really happy I made the graphic. The gra <laughs> now I'm really happy I made you a graphic. <laughs> Aww. <laughs> you bitch, you made me cry. <laughs> All right. So this is fantastic. And now I have a bunch of books which I need to read. I promise I will keep your covers perfect, Chelsea. I promise, okay? I'll keep them nice and in the box until I pull them out. I promise my doggy will not get anywhere near them. But I guess what we've learned from this is book mail is fun. And get yourself a Chelsea because uh, they're pretty great. <laughs> it's pretty great to have a Chelsea. But anyways, this is just a quick video. And I figured since I don't really film unboxings or anything like that, because I don't typically have physical books that I purchase or acquire, that this would be fun to film and Jesus it was! So thank you Chelsea for sponsoring this video and I'm looking forward to all the Sarah J Mats. <laughs> so thanks for watching my channel. Please like and subscribe. Here I'm gonna hold a flower because it's my aesthetic. Here I'm holding a flower. She's gorgeous. It's an amaryllis. It's Christmas time. <laughs> hug, your, hug your bookish friends because they're pretty great. <laughs> Bye!